the boys' swimming season is underway, while Bonzi Valley opens the conference slate at home against Naperville Central, starting the action with the 200 medley relay. It was a close race throughout, but finishing two seconds ahead of a group of Red Hawks was a group of Warriors in Sean Ball, K.N. Lamb, Arpandar, and Alex Schwartz. Next up is the 200-yard freestyle. From start to finish in this race, it's Wobanzi's Tyler Bardak taking control, finishing 9 seconds ahead of teammate Arpon Dar. Moving on to the 200-yard IM. This race was much closer than the last one with Patrick Stern finishing 1.6 seconds ahead of Zedan Lamb. The fastest race of the meet is always the 50 freestyle, and we had a close one as James Berrin finished .27th of a second ahead of Sam Lohman. After the break, we resumed with the 100 Butterfly. It was another close one between K.N. Lamb and Patrick Stern, as Lamb just edges out Stern, winning with a time of 53-49. The 100-yard freestyle is our next race, and it was a close one. The top three were separated by just one second, as Tyler Bardak won this one over Sam Lohman and Alex Schwartz. Time for our second relay of the night with the 200 freestyle. Last year, Wabanzi had one of the strongest relay teams in the conference, and this season is no different as Tyler Bardak, K.N. Lamb, Sam Lohman, and Alex Schwartz picks up the win for the Warriors. Flipping over for the backstroke, we had another close race between a Red Hawk and a Warrior as Wabanzi's Sean Ball won by 1.21 seconds over James Barron. The last race we'll cover in this meet is the 100 breaststroke, and capping off a strong meet for the Warriors is K.N. Lamb, who wins his fourth race of the night. That would help Wabanzi Valley to a 93-79 victory over Naperville Central. Yeah, so we're really excited this year. We have a super strong freshman class, and we have a lot of returning guys who approved a lot over the offseason. So I think we're really strong contenders at state this year and we're really looking to put on a show for everyone. So we have really good team chemistry. I think we've always had it. A lot of the guys, we've swum on the same club team as well. So it really helps with building that. We get to practice with each other and race each other all the time. And I think that we all have a competitive edge to us. So it really helps in our relays. We're pushing each other and fighting the other teams.